All right, coming okay. to you live you. from Sunset Boulevard at Sushia Restaurant. We're rocking it here on uh, Sunset after a nice meal. We've been hanging out with uh, Mr. Ty Lopez all day. You can see him over there. And we're at dinner here at Sashia, the Gilly Angel. This is my mate Martin. What are we doing? You're on Periscope. Last call. You're on Periscope. So last call? Nah, I'm good, thank you. If you guys want to ask a question about video games, I got two of the world's best video game reviewers here. Right here. You want to ask a question? Make sure you ask. Yeah, I'm wearing these blue blocking glasses. If, you, if you're in the US right now, text the word blue blockers to 22444 and I'll send you a text message with a way you can check out these blue blocking glasses. Puppet TV, swaddle. Gilly Angel says Halo 5. No, it's not Halo 5, is it? So this is Dion. What's your YouTube channel, Dion? Uh, you can find me at iMaverick. I M A V, the number three R I Q. So what's the what's the top video game right now? Oh, for me or yeah, for you in the world. For me, I would say Madden because I'm a sports guy. Maybe NBA 2K in the world. League of Legends. <laughs> All right, League of Legends. All right, League of Legends. There you go. Uh, Lindsay PS3013, Joy Papa T. So listen, do me a favor right now. I want you to tweet this out. So touch your screen, scroll down a little bit, and then just retweet this. Let's get some more people on the call right now. And if you do that, I will give you a big shout out. Lindsay PS13, hello from Oklahoma. How you doing? We've got Anton. You want to? We've got another Australian here. You want to ask another Australian accent? How's it going, mate? <laughs> there you go, another Aussie. Tire barking instructions. Hello from Finland. Titsay Mila, I was there. Orton Jeff shared it on Twitter. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Lindsay Pierce 13 shared on Twitter. Thank you. Anyone it's... speaking French out there? But uh, parlez-vous français? Oui, parlez-vous français? J'étudie à l'école et l'université. Uh, J'étudie français à l'école et l'université et je visitais la Paris en 1999 pour le Coupe du Monde de rugby et aussi je visitais la Nice aussi en 1999 pour le Coupe de Davis de tennis. Ah, C'est très bon, tu parles très bien français. Merci. <laughs> <laughs> Was that any French people watching right now? Was my French all right? Was it okay? I don't know. Could have been all right. Yeah, was my was accent all right? It yeah, was okay. Very good. You understood what I was saying? Totally. Okay. Cool. Thank you. Axta twenty says. So, what do you guys want to talk about? We can talk about anything. We can talk about sleep. You want to talk about these blue locking glasses? We can talk about the thirty day no alcohol challenge. Martin can teach you something. What do you want to teach, Martin? Anything. You want to talk about internet marketing, customer care, sales. There you go. you got a business. You can ask questions. Uh, enjoyed your Sports Center story earlier today. Thank you very much. Cool. You saw me on the live call. There's Ty over there. Uh, tell us about backlinking and SEO, says Puppet TV. Can you tell me about that? Uh, about backlinking SEO? Oh, what do, you, what do you want to know exactly? Of course. Yeah, ask can... be a bit more specific. Ty loves doing Snapchats. Uh, more specific, can you ask a more specific question? If you're just joining us, retweet this out right now. Let's get more people on the call. Touch your screen and retweet it and share it. And if you do that, I'm going to give you a big shout out. Okay? So the Gilly Angel says demographics. Puppet TV says where can I get solid links? So the best way to do a solid link is to exchange link with solid website. You know, so you can look at their PR rank. You look. You do a research with the keyword you want to rank for, and you take the top ten website, and you send them an email, and you just exchange link. That's okay. the best way to do it. Are edu links any good? I didn't. I didn't get it. Edu an edu link. I don't know what that is either. I don't know what it is. Either. I'm not sure. More food? Is there more food? More food? Where's more food? food around James. Yeah. James will just... If you yeah. gave that to James right now, <laughs> he'll eat the whole thing. James, tell the truth. It is true. It is true. I can't believe there's any amount of food that James wants. That's it. That is a, a rare unicorn of life. We're stuck in the matrix. There's food around James. I need... 
I just wanted, I wanted to be polite, you know? Like. To be taken and thrown away, James? <laughs> it's like my mum said to me, think about the starving children in Ethiopia. That was like when in the early 80s when I was a little boy, that it was like the big thing. Save ten countries. <laughs> one time we went to Universal. And that was the most food. I grew up with a stepdad that could eat a lot. You almost ate as much. That's because I, they brought these ribs, more ribs than I've ever seen. Or what was it? And I couldn't eat it all. And yeah. then you had a huge thing and then ate the whole rack of ribs and it had more. Big dog's got to eat. Big dog's got to eat. I had 18 bowls of ice cream once at a party. <laughs> that was... <laughs> It was 18 bowls of two scoops of vanilla ice cream. It was just delicious ice cream. I just, it was like Pringles, you know. Once you pop, you just can't stop. It was just like, it just, you just go on a roll, you know. That's hilarious. 18 bowls. My stepdad used to when I was a little. I was about eight, and he would get don't two dozen donuts and do a contest who could eat the most. I was like seven, so I'd eat one and pull, and he'd eat 23 in like two minutes. <laughs> And then he'd always have a headache, and my mom would say it's because of sugar, and they'd get in a fight because he would say it wasn't anything to do with the donut. I my childhood memories. Not the best marriages. They would argue over. She's like, stop having sugar. It's why you get a headache. He's like, it's nothing to do with the sugar. She's like, you just ate 23 donuts in two minutes, and then got a migraine. He would get migraine. What's the most that you? What's the most that you can eat? Like, what's your go-to food where you can just keep chowing down? Beef and eggs. I used to on a farm. Me and this guy, Geronimo. The only thing we didn't have any money, but we could eat anything on the farm that they couldn't sell. We take the cracked eggs, and we used to eat 36 eggs for breakfast. He'd get 18, and I'd get 18, and a big thing of bread. Oh my goodness! I'll tell you this: on the Amish farm, those people could eat more than you, James. Really? Well, the Amish got those huge hands. You pointed out the other night that guy who had those... They were monster hands. I put a photo of me and his hand on Instagram and got, like, the most likes I've ever got. Yeah, and his Amish. hand's not just long. Amish finger, the second you shake a farmer, not just a farmer, even Joel Salatin, when you shake their hands, you're always like, who the hell is this guy? It's like a bionic guy. Didn't you feel yeah. that way? Yeah. But it was also still kind of, like, soft and comforting. It wasn't like... <laughs> It wasn't like. <laughs> it wasn't like too much detail. <laughs> James, were you comforted by another man's hands? I was. They were very soft and slender. I want to stop that conversation before it goes downhill. <laughs> All right, time to wrap it up. I gotta go home and get some sleep. This was fun. So we're gonna wrap this up here from uh, Sunset Boulevard here in Sashia Restaurant. If you like this. Go to my, uh, go to Twitter and tweet this out. Just tell me what you enjoyed about this Periscope. I'm at James Swanick. And also, actually, if you go to my uh, Snapchat in the next two minutes, Martin's going to give you one tip for how to get drive more traffic to your website here, okay? Martin's going to give you, so if you've got a website and you want to drive more traffic, Martin's going to give you one tip on how to do that. So go to my Snapchat, at James Swanick. Also, follow me on Facebook, James Swanick, as well. I'm doing a lot of live calls there. All right, so tweet this out. Turn to my Twitter, at James Swanick, and say, hey, whatever you liked about this. But go to Snapchat in two minutes. Martin is going to reveal the number one dr way to drive traffic to your website, okay? Hey, Snapchat, two minutes. James Swanick, see you there. Hi, I'm James Swanick, and thank you so much for watching this video. If you'd like to check out another video from me, you can just click here, and to subscribe, just click there. <laughs>